to uh, Courchevel, Courchevel to Geneva, Switzerland, Geneva, Switzerland to London, London to Paris, Paris back to London, then went over to, went to Israel, I went to Tel Aviv, then Jerusalem back to Tel Aviv, and then I went to Athens, then Santorini, then I left Santorini, and went over to India, and I've been over in Dubai for like last 40 or 50 days. Mm. See, you know, um, what I've been doing, just traveling the world, building generational wealth. Uh, I'm building generational wealth for my children, as well as my grandchildren. So. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Blue Blood Sports TV, back at y'all with another one. So Floyd Mayweather, as you heard, his response to being stuck over in Dubai and his response to Javante Tank Davis and Curtis 50 Cent Jackson and the rest of the world. You have somebody else from Dubai that's currently stating that uh, Floyd Mayweather is definitely stuck in Dubai because he owes millions upon millions upon millions of dollars over in Dubai for obligations he did not fulfill. Floyd Mayweather is saying he's all about peace. Yet he was going back and forth with his former protege, a fighter formerly under his banner in Javante Tank Davis. Uh, he was going that and gloating about another former protege of his that recently took a loss, and that is Devin the Dream Haney. Uh, in doing so, in spite of Devin Haney's father, trainer, and manager, Bill Haney, right? Uh, he put up a milk carton picture of Bill uh, Haney saying, where's Bill Haney? Now, Bill Haney, he stated that this is the Mayweather era is over. This is the Devin Haney era, right? And Floyd Mayweather didn't take too kind of that. But prior to Devin Haney losing the fight, Floyd Mayweather did nothing and said nothing, okay? He wasn't on anything. Uh, he wasn't on social media. He wasn't doing interviews. He wasn't responding to Devin Haney or Bill Haney. But the moment that Devin Haney lost to Ryan Garcia last Saturday, uh, this past weekend, uh, Floyd Mayweather did plenty of interviews on any platform. Now, it's extremely hard to get Floyd Mayweather on the platform, but he was available. He made himself very available because he wanted to gloat about Devin Haney taking a loss, and he was telling the world how it was still the Mayweather era. Then he threw shots at Javante Tank Davis, uh, stating that, you know, uh, he didn't have to, through his career, he never had to uh, put hydration clauses and, uh, and, and have... Um, you know, catch weights when he had fights. Now, he mentioned uh, the fight he had with one Saul Canelo Alvarez, where that fight was at a catch weight of 152 pounds, but that was on Canelo Alvarez to Floyd Mayweather's defense. Canelo Alvarez thought that uh, he was going above and beyond to try to make the fight happen with Floyd Mayweather. He thought he was trapping Floyd Mayweather. He said, I'll fight Floyd Mayweather at catch weight of 152 just to secure the fight. And Floyd Miller said, okay, then make it happen at 152. But there still was no rehydration clause to Floyd Miller's defense. Uh, Canelo Alvarez rehydrated to whatever way he so choose. Uh, and so uh, that was a shot at Javante Tank Davis, who had the biggest fight of his career uh, uh, last April when he took on Ryan Garcia. It was the most lucrative marquee fight of Javante Tank Davis' career. And it was at a catch weight of 136, and it was a 10-pound rehydration clause. So he was poking shots at Javante Tank Davis and Devin Haney. And he had guys like Ishe Smith in the chat and people was going at Floyd Mayweather. Then he was calling out Bill Haney and then Bill Haney absolutely blasted him on their social media. And he's poking at Javante Tank Davis. Then he stated that Javante Tank Davis had a little zesty, a uh, little bit of sugar in his tank. If you don't know, uh, if you're under a rock, Javante Tank Davis's uh, nickname is Tank Davis. So he's saying he had a little sugar in his tank. OK, uh, Tank Davis then has been responding ever since every day, every moment he gets at Floyd Mayweather. He is not pumping the brakes. He's no whole bars at Floyd Mayweather. And he stated that Floyd Mayweather is trapped over in Dubai. And then there's people coming out saying that Floyd Mayweather is absolutely trapped in Dubai. Floyd Mayweather's responding. As you heard, Floyd Mayweather said he's not trapped in Dubai. He just spent 50 days in Dubai because he's building generational wealth and he's traveling the world. Listen to what he had to say once again. To uh, Courchevel, Courchevel, to Geneva, Switzerland, Geneva, Switzerland, to London, London to Paris, Paris back to London, then went over to, went over to Israel, I went to Tel Aviv, 
then Jerusalem back to Tel Aviv, then then I went to Athens, then Santorini, then I left Santorini and went over to India. Then I've been over in Dubai for like the last forty or fifty days. Mm. See, you know, um, what I've been doing is just traveling the world, building generational wealth. Uh, I'm building generational wealth for my children as well as my grandchildren. So. so you heard Floyd Mayweather's response. Javante Tate Davis has been telling the world, tell Floyd Mayweather to go live again and tell him to show where he's at. So let's see how this unfolds and plays out. Javante Tate Davis got a fight coming up in June against Frank the Ghost Martin. Floyd Mayweather is also directing Tank Davis to fight Shakur Stevenson. That's all I got for y'all. Make sure you hit the like button. Drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. Y'all already know what it is. It's your boy Blue, Blue Blood Sports TV. Hate, like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Hit the bell icon to get all the new notifications. Follow me on Instagram at Blue Blood Sports TV. All one word. That's all I got for y'all. I'm gone. Peace.